Corporal Jeffrey Owen Barnes, Marine Barracks Windward, Guantanamo Bay, Cuba. Corporal Barnes, name some reasons why a Marine would receive a code red. Being late for platoon or company meetings, keeping his barracks in disorder, falling back on a run. Have you ever received a code red? Yes, sir. We were doing seven-man assault drills and my weapon slipped. It was just because it was over 100 degrees and my palms were sweaty and I'd forgotten to use the resin like we were taught. And what happened? That night, the guys in my squad threw a blanket over me, took turns punching me in the arm for five minutes, and then they poured glue on my hands. And it worked, too, because I ain't never dropped my weapon since. <clears throat> was Private Santiago ever late for platoon meetings? Yes, sir. Was his barracks ever in disorder? Yes, sir. Did he ever fall back on a run? All the time, sir. Did he ever, prior to the night of September 6th, receive a code red? No, sir. Never? No, sir. You got a code red because your palms were sweaty. Why didn't Santiago, this burden to his unit, ever get one? Dawson wouldn't allow it, sir. Dawson wouldn't allow it. The guys talked tough about Santiago, but they wouldn't go near him. They were too afraid of Dawson, sir. Object. The witness is speculating. I'll rephrase. Jeffrey, did you ever want to give Santiago a code red? Yes, sir. Why didn't you? Because Dawson would kick my butt, sir. Good enough. Captain Ross is going to ask you some questions. Corporal Barnes. I hold here the Marine outline for recruit training. Are you familiar with this book? Yes, sir. Have you read it? Yes, sir. Good. Would you turn to the chapter that deals with code reds, please? Sir? Just flip to the page of the book that discusses code reds. Well... Well, you see, sir, code red is a term that we use. I mean, just down at Gitmo. I don't know if Oh, we're well, luck then. In... Standard operating procedure, rifle security company, Guantanamo Bay, Cuba. Now, I assume we'll find the term code red in its definition in that book. Am I correct? No, sir. No? Corporal Barnes, I'm a Marine. Is there no book, no manual or pamphlet, no set of orders or regulations that lets me know that as a Marine, one of my duties is to perform code reds? No, sir. No book, sir. No further questions. Corporal, would you turn to the page in this book that says where the mess hall is, please? <laughs> well, Lieutenant Caffey, that's not in the book, sir. You mean to say in all your time at Gitmo, you've never had a meal? No, sir. Three squares a day, sir. I don't understand. How did you know where the mess hall was if it's not in this book? Well, I guess I just followed the crowd at chow time, sir. No more questions. Corporal Barnes, you may step down. Thank you, sir. 